Well, it's Easter today and billions of people are celebrating the holiday this year. But for one Knoxville man, today is not a day of celebration. Instead, it's a day of anticipation. In just 48 hours, he will sit face to face with the person accused of killing his mother. This son told 10 News reporter Chris Lucas he's not seeking justice. Instead, he wants to share a message of forgiveness. A mother's love brings comfort. A few years ago, someone took away Trotter's mother. On March 8th of 2020, my mother, Juliana, and Millie were murdered in a triple homicide. Trotter says the phone call that gave him the news was hard. My first thought was, you know, you can go back to drinking to relieve yourself of this pain. You can go back to using drugs. It triggered a part of himself he had overcome. But even as I was having those thoughts, I had a supernatural presence come over me and just held me. And it was God holding me saying, I've got you. This was not the first time he had to lean on to his faith. I was the worst of the worst. I was the person when you pass on the street, you look at them and you can physically see that they appear to be hopeless. I was dirty. I was homeless. I was sleeping in laundry rooms. I was committing every type of crime. Trotter now has more than 10 years in recovery and addiction taught him a big lesson. The person that I am is not the things that I did. It's that same lesson that guides him for the man accused killing his mother. I have forgiven the person that killed my mom and it's because I received forgiveness first. Trotter now helps other people struggling with addiction to turn their lives around. And the man charged with this triple homicide is Desmond Ree. And the trial starts this coming Thursday, Tuesday, excuse me.